Realistic Joneses is about a couple called the Joneses, and the husband of this couple is um, got a, uh, an unknown new illness that's terminal, and they're coping with his death. And into the neighborhood moves another couple called the Joneses. And it's a play that's sort of about keeping up with the Joneses, although in this instance they're keeping up with things that surprise them, which is moving towards the end of their lives. The other gentleman has also an illness. And it's about people, how they cope with serious, unknowable death. And it's a very lovely story, a very funny story, a very warm and humorous story. The suspense in every scene is sort of like, um, um, if you think of a Manet painting, uh, the water, water lilies, right? They're especially the late, time, late ones in his uh, work. It's, uh, they're very abstract. You can still tell they're water lilies. And it feels like every line is sort of a dab and a dash and a color. And it's only by the end of the scene that suddenly you see what the image is. What do I hope that people take away from the play is a um, sense of love as the only triumph over death, as the only way to get past it. And that it's the small things that help us to survive our fears about mortality. It's little things, it's the kindnesses, the small kindnesses, the shared things, the things that allow us to get from one moment to the next, because in the end, it's always gonna end badly, as the character says.